very good morning to you. Thank you, Mrs. H. Yet again. Beautiful. Colour them, colour them. You should see them in the intro, hopefully. Um, welcome to the shave, midweek shave, Wednesday shave. Here again, Wednesday, Sunday, Wednesday, Sunday. Goes quick. Um, very quick. Weeks ago, very, very quickly. So, another sort of pick and choose shave today. So I thought I'd go for this. Uh, it is logo Gillette and this is their ball end tech three piece um non adjustable it is a quite a light i think it's a hollow handle in there uh three piece non adjustable blade's going to go in is this uh, wilkinson sword and this is its third use I put it back in its uh, in this little wrapper. There you go. I can't speak, can't lie. British razor, this made in England. Very, very simple. Very overhang to be well. Very, very simple razor. Um, works very well. That would have been a good travel razor, I expect. Work razor. Diamond knurling, head heavy. Uh, balance point if you're interested, is there. So uh, that's that. Now this, with <laughs> Tale of Old Bond Street, German Street Collection uh, Shaving Cream for Sensitive Skin. Um, this is very old. Uh, these have usually got a 12 month use by date on them. That's just for, um, for the company to be safe sort of thing, but uh, this is way past that it's many years old uh, it started life out there's the cover look at the cover as a cream it is now quite hard at the bottom there not a lot left there's some water and blooming on the top that's going to be my pre-shave the scent this is one of my favorites uh table bond street scents this uh this one uh, absolutely just the top end posh i used to call it Top end scent, beautiful. Um, I also like the platinum, like a silver tub. And there's um, Forest, Royal Forest, I think it is. Uh, that's another one. Some nice scents, but this has always been my favourite. Brush, DS Cosmetic, the ice blue handle. Beautiful, that. And it's like a marbling in the top half and the blue resin on the base. It is low good. And this is a mixed knot. Using a few badges and balls and things lately, going back a bit to what how I started. Uh, although I think my favourite would be synthetics now, for ease of use, quick to lather. They give out as they create lather fantastically. They also give it out. Um, but these work well. Obviously, I started out with these. This is a badger and ball brush, twenty six millimeter knot. Um, feels quite a high dense knot together it's um good backbone very soft when it's wet it surprised me when i first used this this will be its second use um that's going to just soak in there for for a moment uh, what else is there to tell you no that is it so i'm just going to rinse rinse the face i haven't soaked the brush today so we'll see how we get on with that What I mean soak, I usually leave the brush, any ball or badger. For about 10, rather 10 minutes, 15 minutes. But um, we'll take the pre-shave. Look at that. Oh, I still love this scent. Amazing. It's it's got to be good, doesn't it? When you use as much soap or tried as many soaps, and look at that just from just from the water, um, as I have all these different scents, and this is still one of my favorites. Part of that could be though that I've it was one of the first sort of top end soaps I bought. That's good enough, that's lovely. Release the hands. And we'll 
the uh, that. We'll see how we get on. Hasn't been uh, hasn't been in there long, is it? So it shouldn't make much difference. Any shaves today? Are you too busy? You know, I know some of you shave every day, so um, if you do, well, you're obviously shaving today, but uh, or maybe you're shaving the evening, morning, whatever. If you're retired, you shave whenever you like. <laughs> so um, that'll do. So it's a good dollop on there, gathered, bit of water, and we go straight on. It's so old now this, it's turning into a, a hard soap. <laughs> Lost one of the hairs there. That is common with boar and badger and some synthetic sometimes, but more with boar and badger. Um, the first few uses you can you can see a few hairs coming out. As long as they don't continue to come out, we're okay. Gorgeous scent. Simple as that. Posh. All right, we'll heat the, the ball end tech, Gillette. And we'll go for the first pass. Wilkinson sword, second use. No, it's not. Third use. That's it. Right, we'll put basic aggression. Standard basic. Wow. Good slickness. Very good slickness. And while I'm doing this. I'd just like to say a belated happy birthday um, from last Wednesday, week today, to uh, Sam Evans, if you're watching. Hope you had a great day, Sam. Great birthday. And thanks for watching the videos. And um, hello to Nikki as well and the family. Hope you're all doing well, so. Yeah, a belated happy birthday. Ah, some whiskers coming out there. Love this little razor. Simple as they come. Very inexpensive razor, I think, in this day. And uh, just made to do the job, and the job it's been doing ever since. Great value for money. If you look after these things, the longevity of them and their lives is absolutely amazing. Like anything really, isn't it? They have good slickness. Residual. Oh god, I love that scent. Bit more water. Good backbone on this. Um, there is a slight scratchy feel to this very very slight uh, but that will disappear with use but i don't use it in every shave so it'll go slower for me um but it is nice and soft as well badger and ball lovely and so far it's given me the lather back because sometimes they're little thieves they like to keep it to themselves 
not so bad with it. They suck it up. Here we go, cross the growth. Midweek shave, very, very enjoyable so far. So much to say, very relaxing. All I hope is it's as, as relaxing for you to watch as it is for me to me to do. Warm weather still here. According to the weather forecast, um, it's going to stay nice like this till the end of the week. Well, I think weekend it's going to start to get a bit windy and a bit of rain. Uh, and we do need a bit of rain. All the farmers want a bit of rain. Cross the growth to about there. Because it grows see, slightly that way and uh, so I'm going to cross it now and then here it starts to go down. See and then it went down there. <laughs> Come on, get a grip Paul. Double chin. Right. Mm. And funny enough, for me this brush, uh, some ball brushes and mainly ball, not badger, but some badgers can, um, can have a horrible smell to them when they're new and wet and when you're not used to it you think oh what the hell is this but um this one hasn't at all no nothing at all but i think they do clean them somehow before they when they're new when they make them i think so i'll do something to them i believe don't quote me though. Right, here we go. Against the growth. Very nice. The old Wilkinson saw doing very well. Third use. Might be able to have a couple of barbecues this week, I think. In the evening. I love trying different barbecue sauces and marinades on different meat, on pork, lamb, um, whatever, some burgers. But uh, of late, I've been enjoying a uh, a tandoori a sort of a powder you coat the meat chicken wings whatever and i leave them overnight in a bag give them a rustle around you know toss them around and then cook them and uh, it takes me back to the 80s because tandoori coatings on belly pork and stuff like that was very popular it came in then and uh There was a lot of uh, hype about it. Wow, that's lovely. Yeah, and I've uh, 
it always when I taste it now it always reminds me of that time Three, two, one. Pick up time, baby. Should be just enough in the old brush. Just enough in there. Here we go, pick up time. This is the one here. Jewelry. Perfect. Cold water rinse. That is lovely. So I hope you haven't oh, beautiful. I hope you have some great shaves. Very happy with that. Homemade tea tree witch hazel, which doesn't seem to be going down. I think we've got a phantom topper upper visit in the night. And then we're going to use the matching few years before I bought this to match to match the soap, uh, the cream. Alcohol free this, so it uh, shouldn't sting. Spray, is it? Yeah, spray. So what we'll do is... Uh, and then... Yeah, no sting. We love it. And then the balm, I'm going to use this again. The uh, Gabri Aftershave Cream Cologne. This goes well, it's like a gel, isn't it? This goes well with the, this type of scent. Goes well with this type of scent, if that makes sense. Yeah, really nice. That is good. That is lovely. So we've used uh, very successfully 
the Gillette three-piece non-adjustable ball end tech diamond knurling head heavy with a blade as well um, really nice little maneuverable razor very nice really good medium aggression uh, standard aggression Wilkinson sword blade and that was the third use really nice tail of old Bond Street the German Street collection uh, shaving cream for sensitive skin beautiful stuff as I say it's very old it's near the bottom I'll just rinse this out now and let it dry upside down it's going hard because it's been as I say it's a few years old uh, but as you see works well we've used the DS Cosmetic Ice Blue uh, Mixed Knot Badger and Ball 26mm um, good brush really gathered up you can see it gave me the lather back it didn't hold it all it's uh, really nice works well that um, we've used Welsh water to rinse homemade tea tree and uh, witch hazel and nearly dropped it and the uh, matching German Street collection alcohol free um, aftershave for sensitive skin lovely scent and mixed with this is a really nice scent so it's a uh, it's, it's really good stuff and that's the finish and that's it I'll leave you in peace have a fantastic rest of the week. Um, any shaves you're having, have a good one. If you're waiting for products, I hope they come quickly. <laughs> and uh, I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave again. So all the best, take care of yourselves. Thanks a lot. And I'll see you then. All the best. Bye-bye.